Quick, smash that like and subscribe in the next 10 seconds and you just never know the pink gold trooper may end up in your account once you purchase the green gold trooper on Fortnite Battle Royale. Hey guys, it's Postbox Pat. Welcome back to Fort Nightmares. And today we've got some really exciting information that has been added in today's update. So I'm going to be showing you guys a bunch of map changes. You can even see one on screen right now and some Easter eggs which have been added in today's update. And a little bit of conversation to talk about regarding these map changes with the upcoming map changes on the map. So as we know, throughout season, I guess it was season six when Halloween was, and they added in a bunch of new Halloween features. These features were in each area. For example, in Pleasant Park, they would decorate it with all Halloween decorations. Now we're not just at that time just yet, but we can expect that change to come in very, very soon. You're probably wondering, Pat, why on earth is your game dead purple? Well, we'll explain that in a second, but before we get into that, if you guys want a chance of getting gifted any of the Fortnite Nightmares skins, I will be leaking a few towards the end of this video as well for those wanting all the information on all the upcoming skins. But if you want gifting any of these, remember to comment down below your epic games name entering code postbox pack to the item shop make sure you subscribe to the channel and also let me know in the comments down below your in-game epic name and i'll be sure to give you guys a bunch of skins i've been writing a list of a bunch of people so i hope to get you guys added very soon and get you guys sent a bunch of these fortnite most skins it's gonna be really exciting you can see i've already gifted one on screen right there so if you guys want a chance of getting gifted again make sure you put your name down below in the comments anyway so what is going on with this map change you're probably thinking pat how on earth has this happened why is your map entirely purple well the reason for that is is because of the brand new creative hub unfortunately this is one of the major map changes today and we don't really have anything major going on on the map however we can kind of predict from this what is going to happen which is very exciting so you're not going to want to miss this video guys make sure you stay in tune throughout the entire video i've got a lot of leaks and skins coming towards the end as well some interesting information regarding upcoming changes there so what's going on here is this is actually the fort nightmares texture that we should be able to get when fort nightmares loads in so this is what potentially the map could look like when fort nightmares gets added in the reason for that is is because if you look at the spawn island guys or should i say the creative hub really that's what i really want to say because the creative hub has had a huge map change and it now has its halloween vibes look at this guys this is what the creative hub is going to look like so let me just go right back to the start of the game so it resets for you guys and spawns me right in at the location we need to be because obviously we need to be in this hub for this to work otherwise it's not going to work so we're going to go back to the hub just like this and here we are in the hub right now is it going to let us in the hub oh we've got this barrier we might have to change to drone attached which is perfectly fine so here we are inside of the hub right now so let's press play so it goes a little bit dark there we are and now we are sorted so this is exactly how the creative hub looks right now or the playground hub this is created by users so this is a weekly series which we're going to add to the map change series where we're going to review the hub now because i guess this is a huge map change for playground and creative this is what everyone will get right now if you go into creative or playground this is what will happen you'll get to be on top of the cube you'll get this entire halloween structures these brand new structures which have been added into the game as you can see in here we even have some hus husks in here they're kind of stuck behind this like barrier which is really cool i think that's a really nice unique feature and on the other side we have a nice little church a few little halloween posts up here and these are like the portals where you could go to other maps as well very nicely done and obviously the giant church up here as well which kind of looks like it's just been spawned in but i like the way they've done it with husks inside and stuff it's quite a nice feature a nice little touch especially with the lights they've used as well so really cool look to it with the neon vibe around that we also have the cube returning in this as well you can see the cube up here and obviously the bouncy floor as well you will bounce on this floor guys you can see my character when he loads in he will start bouncing give him a second and i'm sure he will start bouncing right now come on is he gonna bounce is he gonna bounce is he gonna bounce he doesn't seem to be bouncing but you will guys trust me you come over here and you land in here your guy will start bouncing here we go there we are he's bouncing <laughs> he's bouncing there we have it so yeah this is what it's gonna look like this is potentially what the sky could look like as well so in fortnite for nightmares when it drops this is what the sky might actually look like which is very nice to see you can kind of see the texture around the whole island it's really giving the vibe of like the end from minecraft that's what it's given to me anyway unless they've just done this for the creative hub we're not too sure but you can see it does glitch out a little bit and you can start to see the purple ish map over there now if i do happen to kind of change it to the normal game so if i just press play on drone attach you'll see we'll follow my dude and then we spawn in on the actual island the whole island will change now guys and it will now be its original format so wait for it to load in and we'll get to that and obviously this is what the island normally looks like we all know it as the island as kind of like the huge 
obviously this island that you can see right now so this is the island we all know it as this classic green thing so it's nice to see that there it's kind of like an early preview for you guys of what could happen in Fort nightmares so that's a really nice little secret change for today's update if you want to try it out for yourselves just load into playground load in creative and then actually go into the replay system and you'll be able to do all these kind of glitchy type things it's not really a glitch it's just really renders and stuff like that and it's nice to see the map in that purple shade we even have a lot of lighting errors going on on the map right now so you can see this fort nightmares thing that is over in the playground is clearly affecting the entire map this is another halloween look we may get see how the map feels very different the colors are definitely a lot different like the shade is a lot less this might be the vibe we might get it kind of reminds me of like a pumpkin type theme so it's really nice to see but yes we can expect a lot of halloween changes coming in if you guys do know any halloween changes that do appear if you guys see one straight away tweet me at postbox pat and we'll be sure to add it in a video i'm very excited to add all that sort of stuff into the videos for you guys the sort of towns you can expect to get halloween decorations are obviously pleasant and last season we even got the halloween attraction over at fatal fields now as we know fatal fields isn't an actual place in this map but i do think we may see the farm over here get its own little halloween attraction it's even sort of got the halloween colors going on right now which is really exciting guys so hopefully we've teleported back over here to try and get the colors to change back to normal but hopefully we can get some nice colors going on i love that lighthouse it's one of my favorite things in the game so that's my opinion anyway i do think over at the farm we will get that sort of stuff going on but that's it for today's map changes. Now, let's head on over to the leaks, which we've got for all the upcoming Four Nightmares skins. So this one's really exciting for everyone out there, and you will not want to miss what I've got for you guys in store here. Okay, so regarding leaks, we've got a lot of upcoming stuff. And to be honest, some of these skins are really exciting, and we can expect a lot of stuff coming throughout Halloween. Now, if you guys remember the little secret things that we saw over at Gotham, do you guys remember them? Well, they have apparently all been leaked as skins now in the game, which is really exciting. So I'll show you guys some of the posters from Gotham originally before we get into the leaked skins. You can see them popping up right now. But what's really exciting about this is potentially some of these are going to get added into the game. Well, all of them guaranteed which is such good news for all the people that were excited about these and it was kind of like an early teaser for the halloween skins which i think was amazing i did not expect that at all so thank you epic games for the early leak there on the reckoning skins but what have we got for these skins so let's go over them let's talk about which ones we've got and let's just go through every single leak starting from these here so the first one we've got is the formal gas mask man so you can see him right here he was one of the final reckoning and he is pretty cool and pretty awesome we don't know the rarities of these just yet but some really exciting skins coming out i highly recommend saving your v bucks for these and make sure you've got code postbox pat entered in because there's going to be some big ones coming out guys you guys are going to love these skins the next one we've got is bubblegum prison monster he's pretty cool i'm really hyped for him he again is one of the final reckonings maybe there's going to be like a final reckoning set we just don't know just yet what's going to happen but again a nice lovely skin there then we have the mummy with cool hat this is a brand new skin as well unfortunately this one is not part of the final reckoning but you know i think this one is going to be pretty cool and could be one of the top ones throughout the halloween season this year so i think that's going to be nice then we've got scary doll bride who was over at the reckoning inside of gotham so that's nice to see her there she's really cool and a pretty scary one that might be one i might actually purchase because i like to purchase scary skins then the next one we've got for you guys is candle statue orb man i think this guy's pretty cool as well and I don't know if he'll be a skin 100%. He doesn't really look like he's going to be a skin. But obviously anything could be a skin nowadays. We've even seen Slurp Juice as a skin. So that's pretty nice to see right there. And then oh why oh god why man looks like he's the next skin and he looks pretty scary to be honest this guy is probably one of the most scariest ones i've seen we're getting some really scary skins to be honest i did not expect expect this at all i don't think he was part of the gotham set that we saw at the final reckoning then we see the next one is masked which is pretty cool i do really like this sorcerer here masked sorcerer he looks crazy and he i'm not too sure was he one of the gotham ones or not i don't think he was in this case but we're not 100 percent sure on that right there then a few other skins as well which we've seen here from hypex day of the dead skin here which is really nice and then obviously we've got the goth soldier girl she looks really awesome and then we've seen the new skeleton dinosaur skins this could be actually a set 
Next up, we've got the new goal guy. So I guess this is part of the goal trooper set, but it's going to be the guy version of it. Very nice skin. Hopefully we do get this in the pink variant. I think that's something that I'm really upset about, and we'll get to that in a second. We've got the new raptor mask as well coming in. I guess this might not be a skin. This might just be a change for the original raptor. But then again, it could be a brand new variant of raptor himself. It may be put in a set that with the dinosaur skins that we may see in the shop, as in like the actual store where you can buy skins not the item shop so maybe that might happen there then we've got the og gold trooper returning as well so finally we see the return of her and there is a variant of her that gives them more of a zombie look however there's this pink version of her as well which is for the og people that own the gold trooper now the percent of people that actually play that still own the gold trooper is almost i don't know i think it's probably like 0 0.0 nor one percent of people who actually own the gold trooper personally i've not seen the gold trooper in lobby or in game for months now i think it's been over a year so i don't think the pink one should be exclusive exactly or at least make the zombie one exclusive instead because the pink one is so nice you can see it here i'm really upset about that i did really want the pink one not to be exclusive but it happens to be exclusive in this video unfortunately or this announcement so that's sad and i really did want the pink gold shoe to be public but i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video don't forget to go and smash code post box pat in the item shop if you're going to be buying any of these skins you want to make sure you're using code post box pat 100 on them thank you everyone who's been supporting the channel recently much love and respect smash that like smash that subscribe i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video and once again this is post box pat signing out